Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today I'm super excited because we get to review the new Tusa Switch High Flex Pro fin that we've got available on our site. This is a super new cool set of fins. I'm going to move the one guy out the shot over there so we can just get a look at this one because they're both the same. Um, so just to run through, this is the big brother to Tusa's new High Flex Switch fin. This is being the Switch Pro. The main difference being that the blade is 20% stiffer so let's just run through the back and we'll get to the blade in a sec so at the back of the foot pocket over there we said comes with Tusa's awesome all new bungee strap at the back I really like the strap it's different from some of the other bungee ones in the fact that it's not braided it's just the open uh, rubber at the back and it's got a few grooved holes in it making it a little bit lighter and a little bit more flexy for you to pull onto your foot it's got a really great padded section over here for the heel of your uh, of your foot so it's got some really chunky ribs over there that'll hang on the back of your heel on the back of your boot quite well it's got a really big ring over there for you to make it really easy for you to pull on and over your foot it has the uh, standard Tusa foot pocket as Tusa have always had in their range it's super super comfortable it's ergonomic it's got a lot of ribbed grooves rib, ribs and grooves and bumps at the bottom over here which are raised rubber which give you a lot more grip if you're standing off the back of a boat on rocks about to enter the water itself and there's two little drain holes in each side so if you scoop up any water in the fin it'll drain out while you're diving the main technology of the fin comes from this high flex switch pro blade high flex meaning that it's got a really high angle of attack so if i hold this fin straight you can see just how high it goes up and then a really sharp angle of attack to go down which is quite unusual to see in a fin where fins tend to be a lot straighter if I hold that upside down as well, nice and living, you see it goes down, it's got that really high groove over there. There's a really big hole over here and that allows the water to move through the water really quickly. It comes to where the, the fin gets its name, the Switch or the Switch Pro, meaning that this fin makes you highly, highly maneuverable. It's quite a stiff blade, also very, very short in comparison to some other fins. So it's quite a stubby, short little fin, but this thick, chunky rail over there and the angle that it's at and the fact that this is 20% stiffer than the standard Switch means that if you move in the water, that the, your fin will make you move really quickly so you can literally switch and turn and have a look at things really really quickly so if you're one of those hyper hyper active divers want to look around at everything or an instructor or a dive master that needs to keep an eye and just move around really quickly to keep a look on things this is the ideal set of fins for you because as you move through the water as the fin moves you're going to move really quickly as well one of the interesting things to note is the fact that they have two screws on each side over here um, and that's to attach the fin to the foot pocket itself because they're separately molded but that gives this fin a lot more rigidity and stiffness um, and the way the fin is designed although this is just the standard yellow one there is three or four different types of polymer which run through here they call it Purimax uh, technology so the way that they've mixed this polyurethane into the rubber means that it's really strong and super flexible towards the end so as you fin down the fin will cup up and as you push down the fin opens up and that forces the water right out the, the way. I've tested this fin and I find that with the grooves and the skegs that they built in over here you don't have much of that fishtail effect in fact it fins down really really quickly and even now with the stiffer one on the frog kick you find that you get a lot of power as you fin out of it. I tried the standard switch one and it felt a little bit weird doing the frog kick to start because it was quite short and stubby but the stiffer blade you, really gives you some good momentum if you're frog kicking as well and the big hole that they've got over here to allow water to flow through also really helps with those with those frog kicks when you do them so there's that review of the Tusa High Flex Switch Pro Fin available from our site. The upgrade to the standard switch in the fact that it's got a 20% stiffer blade and makes you have a lot more performance in the water for all those twists and turns and fast accelerations if you so choose to do so. There's that review, it comes in a pair, you're going to left and a right and a right and a left and they're omnifootical meaning that it doesn't make a difference whether you put it on the left or the right or the right or the left because they go on either foot. So there's that review. And if you guys are enjoying these product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click over there, it says subscribe. You can also give us a search on all of our social streams. Just give scuba.ca.za a quick little type up and a looky loo, and you'll find that we'll come up on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter, Graham, and oh, you, you name it, we're, we're gonna be there. We put funky photos there of our trips and our training, and also reviews on cool gear. Go give us a search because we're quite cool to follow. 
So that's it from me guys and I look forward to seeing you really soon in the border.